Yeah, once again, welcome to our English lessons. Today, we are going to talk about reading and comprehension. A very nice story, and then we will answer questions on them. Before we start, we will look at some of the keywords. When we talk about keywords, we, we are talking about words that we will meet them in the story. We will look at them, explain them, form sentences with them before we start our lesson. So let's start. Reading and comprehension. Now when you talk of reading and comprehension, reading and comprehension means understanding what you have read. You read a passage and then how to understand it and then answer questions on them. Are we okay? So reading and comprehension means reading and understanding what you have read. Let's go to the keywords. Keywords. Farmer. Coffee. Kitchen. Toilet. Bathroom. Television. Radio. Elder. Younger. Meat. Okay, these are our keywords. So we will say it once again. Whilst I say, then you say it after me. Keywords Farmer Coffee Kitchen Toilet Bathroom Television Radio Elder Younger Meat Okay, let's take these keywords one after the other and explain them and see whether we have seen them somewhere before or we have heard about them before. The first one is Farmer do you know a farmer? Have we heard of the word farmer before? Okay, now when we talk about a farmer, a farmer is someone who grows foodstuffs, someone who works on the farm. The plantain that we eat, the cassava, the tomato, the pepper, and all those things are being produced by people that we call them farmers. The next one, coffee. Now, have you taken coffee before? Coffee. We use this for tea to prepare tea. Coffee. Then kitchen. Kitchen is a place where mommy prepares our delicious food. Food. Toilet. I hope we all know toilet. Where we go and then we be where we go and then poop. That place. Then the next one. Bathroom. Now bathroom is where we take our bath. Celebration. I hope we all know television. That is television. We use television to watch cartoons, listen to music. We do a lot of things on the television. Now, radio. Radio too. We listen to information, music, and other things on the radio. Elder. Elder is someone who is older than you. Your big sister or your big brother. Then, younger. Younger is also someone that you are older than. My younger sister, my younger brother. Then meat. When you talk of meat, meat is something that is clean. A place which is clean. You've swept that place neatly. My bedroom is very neat today. Okay. So these are our keywords. The words that we will meet them in our comprehension. So let's start with our comprehension. Now when I read, you read after me. Okay, the title of our comprehension is My Father's House. My Father's House. Someone is coming to tell us about the, the house that his father has built or her father has built. All of us, our fathers have houses. We live in our father's house. So someone is telling us about his father's house. My father is a farmer. Read after me. My father is a farmer. He grows cocoa and coffee. He grows cocoa and coffee. He grows plantain, cassava and yams too. He grows plantain, cassava and yams too. He sells what he grows. He sells what he grows. He has a lot of money. He has a lot of money. He has built a beautiful house. He has built a beautiful house. 
There are ten rooms in my father's house. There are ten rooms in my father's house. There is a big hall. There is a big hall. We have two bathrooms and two toilets. We have two bathrooms and two toilets. There is a big kitchen in the house. There is a big kitchen in the house. My mother prepares our meals in the kitchen. My mother prepares our meals in the kitchen. My younger brother and I sleep in one of the rooms. My younger brother and I sleep in one of the rooms. My elder sister sleep in another room. My elder sister sleep in another room. Uncle Owusu has a room in my father's house. Uncle Owusu has a room in my father's house. Aunt Esther and her child sleep in her room. Aunt Esther and her child sleep in her room. My father has a radio and a television set in the hall. My father has a radio and a television set in the hall. There are big chairs in the hall. There are big chairs in the hall. We sweep all the rooms every morning. We sweep all the rooms every morning. My father's house is always very neat. My father's house is always very neat. Very good. Let's give ourselves one smiling clap. Mm. 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 Very good. Now this is our comprehension. This is our story. We have read it together. Now I hope you can read it on your own. And then some of the words that you don't understand, you will ask Auntie Barbara and then she will explain it to you on WhatsApp. These are our keywords, the words we saw all of them in the comprehension. We know a hall. Our father is having a big house, a hall in there. Now this is the end of our lesson. Thank you and answer all the questions nice and neat. Bye-bye.